Yo! So this is where I say some dramatic catching phrase because that's how it is uh, to get your attention. Like something that's like, oh my gosh, we almost sold out of Axe Bells. Uh, just to get your attention. Uh, but anyway, I like starting these with, hi, I'm Brandon. I'm from Whiskey River Trading and uh, it's Whiskey River Weekly. So here we go. Ready? Axe Bells. They're in stock. Ready to ship. Now, we got a little flack on having extras, but we had the material, we made extras. It is what it is. They were like, yo, do you want us to use all the boards that came in? I'm like, yeah, everything that's usable. Uh, there's no use in ha having us having these stashed on, some lumber stashed on a shelf and not made into bells. So we finished the pre-order guys. Those are all shipped out. We, uh, we have a handful of these extras left. We did a limited run of white oak. Those are sold out. Um, so, Appreciate everybody who supported us with the pre-order because that project, that that pre-order project is what pays for the tooling and the design and all of the setup costs that we have on this first run. Now these will be in stock regularly, just like everything else on our website, most likely sold out all the time. But um, when they're not, then they're not sold out. We're going to be doing these limited runs um, over the next however long we decide to do them. So, um, but once these sell out, I'm not sure how soon uh, of a restock we're gonna have. I've got an order in with them, but you know, there's production time and all that in place and shipping and all that. So if you want one, uh, I'm rambling, but if you want one, you should grab one now. If not, uh, you should wait and uh, pick one up later. Axe Bells in stock now. The other news is we got an auction that's live right now. And I got this cool salesman sample, like carrying case, right? This is a Keen Cutter brand. Keen Cutter, stamped big Keen Cutter on the back. This is like a, uh, a leather and canvas combo. I'm gonna set it up here, open this up. So this flips down like this. This is where saws would have been stored. There's like uh, these slats for Carpenter saws and stuff. There's a tray inside that comes all the way out. It's canvas lined. This is available on the auction site. It's a pretty cool piece. It's not probably something that you see very often. The strap is not original. However, the hardware there attach is attached to the box for a handle and for a strap. If you wanted to sew up like a, a nice leather strap, I'm sure it was leather. Um, little brass keen cutter tag on the top. You can see all the photographs of these. This on the bid.whiskeyrivertrading.com website where the auction is live. I wanted to show you a couple other items that we've got. Boys axe, kick head, fire axe, like a school bus axe, 24 inch handle. It's like a three pound overall. We got this clean Tommy with both claws on original handle. A cut sure etched axe. Uh, it looks like a Dayton. It has uh, a little bit of worn toe, but it's, uh, it's still got a lot of life in it. And it's etched. It's out of Cincinnati, Ohio, which is pretty cool. A uh, whole pile of these, uh, not a whole pile, we've got a handful of these pick heads, right? About this size, five, six pounds available on the auction. And then last and certainly not least is a True Temper Kelly Perfect with bevels, double bit in really good shape. So there's plenty of others that I'm not showing in these. These are just my favorites that I uh, have been told that I should share with you guys if I've got favorites. So there they are. We got so, we got like a new old stock-ish council tool axe that's in there. It's like a miner's axe, three and a half pounds, pretty neat. Original paint, sticker on the head and all that. It's probably 80s, 90s era. Um, check that out. But yeah, auction ends early October. Now, uh, in other news, we have uh, this slight issue. It's Friday, right? And this morning I got an email from a customer who sent me a link. WhiskeyRiverTrading.shop. Not .com. We're .com. This uh, phishing website that's hosted on WordPress is a look-alike website. Looks like us, but it's not us. And uh, it, it's basically harvesting people's credit card information. They've got our products, like select products pulled over from their website or from our website. And they took our photographs and our product description. And they have the prices just obnoxiously low, right? Where you're like, hey, heck yeah, this is a really good deal. So you buy it and then you get your credit card information stolen. That's not us. Don't buy from them. 
If you see a website that looks like our website, that's not our website, just email us. Be like, yo, is this you? You know, but we have a website. It's whiskeyrivertrading.com. We've got, we're on Etsy. We're on, we were on eBay. We're not on eBay much anymore. And then we're on the auction site. So like, that's it. Just let us know. Customer service at whiskeyrivertrading.com or me directly, Brandon at whiskeyrivertrading.com. If you're trying to get a hold of us and you're a little concerned or a little uh, worried, that might not be us. Um, and we're working as hard as we can to get a hold of WordPress directly, but you know, they're a big company. They probably don't really care about this situation. Obviously there's going to be scams out there and I'm sure that they are working very hard on trying to get this pulled down. However, uh, if you guys know anybody from WordPress that works at WordPress, anybody who knows somebody who knows somebody that works at WordPress, have them reach out to me. Uh, Email, DM, whatever, get all of us, uh, because we want to get this resolved as soon as possible. So, anyway, be good, stay sharp, have a good weekend, and uh, I hope that pile, pile of firewood's growing because it's about to get cold. See you guys.